heard from a little birdie that you actually loved to cook. Yes. And you went to Paris to study. I did. I did. I always liked to cook as a little kid. I, I remember like when I was little and we would have library time in school and I would get a regular book to read and bring home like some sort of a kid's cookbook. Loved to make recipes. And uh, so I just decided, you know what, I'm just going to take a class here after work. And it was so much fun. It was so fulfilling. It was creative, you know, really artistic. And um, there was just a, a major gratification at the end of the day. So I took another one. And then I took another one. And then I thought, you know what? They kept saying to me, you should enroll in the professional program here. And then if you want, you can go off you know, to Paris and study more. So that's what I did. But I continued to cook for myself. You know, I lived all over the country and different places in the news business. And so I always was alone and always had a kitchen and always made fabulous big meals and, and that sort of thing. And um, just kind of stayed in touch that way. And then I got married and had kids. Okay, speaking of your family and having a child, did the idea for this book, which is called The Quick and Clean Diet, come about because you had a child and you wanted to teach him how to eat clean? It was a few things. Yes, it was um, all of a sudden being in that position of I have a child, I have a serious professional career, a career that is very much based upon how you look, and a, you know, a constraint of time where you kind of have to get things back together. And also, I had been exposed for so many years of, you know, people, I mean, you're a celebrity. Hello. Well, I came uh, you know, on like your show and talked about my raw diet. Trying to stay in shape and the pressure of staying <laughs> right, in shape yeah. and, and, you know, yo-yoing and all that. And the pressure that society puts on women and the pressure that women put on themselves, it's utterly ridiculous. And I felt it. And so, you know, there was this little voice in me saying, I really feel like I have a platform here to tell women to relax but at the same time to educate. Your book is, is different than any of the books that I had ever written because I just go out and say, these are the recipes, this is what you should do, this is how you should change over to raw. But what you did was you broke it down into three separate stages. Yes. What are the three separate stages? Okay, high motivation, which is the it's the, really the jump into it. You just got to jump into it because in order to be, see results, in order to feel better, you really just have to cut out certain things. So I will say maybe the first, the first day is not so bad, but day two and three are a bit of an adjustment because your body says, what in the world just happened? But after that, you start to feel really amazing. You feel euphoria because your body starts to turn the corner and it appreciates what you're giving it and it doesn't mi miss what it's lost. So then the next phase you, you walk into, and you'll lose a, a lot of weight in the beginning there and you will f just have so much more energy and you won't be tired and drag from all the, the stimulants and the, the bad stuff you were eating. So the next stage, is the grounding stage and that is kind of a, a, a leveling out stage. You're not going to lose as much weight but you're still going to lose weight and you can start to add in a few more things because the idea here is not deprivation. It's basically resetting your clock. That's all we're doing here is resetting your body. You will never be without the things that you love and then after that stage three is stability. That is for life. That is where you basically have your mind has changed. Your body's changed but also your mind and you know how important it is to change your mind when you're doing these things so your mind is basically driving this boat and your body is following along now because it appreciates all of the benefits so basically your book is trying to help people get their diet their cravings under control because I think taking them through these three steps really helps them to understand how they get into the rut in the first place and how to dig themselves out. Now you've brought some things that you really like in yes. your diet that helps you because it gives flavor to, to food. Absolutely. They're, they're nutritional and the other thing um, is, yeah, you have to like what you're eating. I mean, you can't eat cardboard else right. it's not going to work no, for, for you. Sure. Absolutely. So one of the things that I, well, cinnamon is really, really, really good. And, and very healthy um, for you. It's very, very healthy for you and it's got a, it's actually has a natural sweetness to it um, and it's very it's it's also very good for your blood one of my favorite is salt yes. which is not re your regular table salt no, of course it's not. you need not very talking about healthy salt exactly. exactly and you like a little bit of coconut oil you know about coconut yeah, oil I actually oil. put it on my body cuz I don't really like the flavor of coconut oil but olive oils and like Udo's choice oils which right. are cold pressed oils right 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 and olive oil you should put in the refrigerator make sure you know for a couple days to make sure it solidifies so you know it's 
only olive oil and that it's true and it's pure. Okay, so Bragg's liquid aminos. I really like this and this They're comes very in the salty spray. Tasting, so it is very, very careful. salty yes. tasting. So here's what I, I like to do is if you steam some broccoli, and then you can just sort of spritz it very right. lightly on here and it works out really well and it gives it a, a little bit of salty taste and it's, right. it's made from soy protein. Soy protein. So that's a lot, 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 lot better. Derry, I think this is a great book. I think it really explains to people what they need to do, how they need to do it, and why they need to do it. And that was very important. I think people need to know why they do it. It's the quick and clean diet. You look great, so it Thank must you. work. So do you. <laughs> so does the raw diet. Thanks for coming on the Thank show. Thank you. Thank you, Carol.